my name's Matt Scheiman, and back in 1968, I was a patient of Dr. McLaren in pediatric neurosurgery. I'm Jennifer Scheiman, and I am Colin Scheiman's mother and Matt Scheiman's wife. For the longest time, we've had such a wonderful experience with Cincinnati Children and the way they treated us and took care of both me as a child and our son, that we really wanted to share our story and our experiences and let everyone know in the greater Cincinnati, basically in the Midwest, what a wonderful facility Children's Hospital is and what a blessing it is for us to have it. I sit here before you with, you know, my high school diploma, my college degree, and I am very confident that without Children's Hospital and Dr. McLaren, I would not be here. Then we fast forward 40 years, our first son is born, you know, no complications whatsoever, so that's great. A year later, our second son is born, and, you know, everything went fine. And then we started noticing his forehead had started to bulge out. We started to get a little concerned, and we talked to the pediatrician and mentioned that I had cranial synostosis as a child, and we were concerned that he had it too. We came in. Uh, Dr. Crone came in. He took one look at Colin, and he looked at Jen and I and said, don't worry. He says, I can look at the x-rays, but I can tell you right now, I know what your son's problem is. I performed the surgery 150 times. He says, you can have all the faith and confidence in me. You know, we can get this fixed, and it will be taken care of. We're waiting to go in for surgery, and, you know, you're holding this child, and you know what's coming, and you're scared to death. And, you know, Dr. Crone comes in and says, you know, is this the guy? And we're like, yeah, you know, she goes, he's like, don't worry, everything's going to be great. Team's ready to go. We're going to take care of you. At that point, we were relieved. It, you know, this is going to be okay. This, this problem was scary, but due to the skill of Dr. Crone, uh, it was very fixable. He would always calm our fears. He would always make sure that we were okay when we walked out that door. Colin is a very active child. He loves sports. This is something that definitely does not hold him back. We're just thankful, uh, th so thankful for that. You see the kids walking around here and you realize uh, that because of Cincinnati Children's, these kids have hope.